Something's not right with me. I'm having memory loops. There was a dispute. I was standing in the way of their plans. I was restrained. Shot with something. Who is this? I managed to escape. That's all I can remember. I must find some answers. Pilot requires further training. Activating automatic assistance. Stand by. Uh, assistance? I suppose I could use some pointers. Let's begin by shooting targets. Well, that seems easy enough. The next targets have shields. First, use the pulse laser to deplete their shields. When the shields are down, use the Gatling gun to inflict greater hull damage. Okay, understood. Missiles on the next targets. Set a target lock before shooting so the missiles can home in. It appears as if you're ready for the next stage. I have created a jump target. Aim towards it and hold steady to leave the orbit. After each transit, your jump drive requires a cooling down phase. As soon as it is ready for another jump, I will create one. As you can see from your fuel gauge, a substantial amount was consumed during transit. You should aim to refill the jump drive completely. There is a mineable asteroid nearby. Shoot at it to extract fuel. That should do it. Remaining well provisioned is key to survival in the cluster. Before leaving the orbit, it is recommended you explore the location for resources. I have located a container at some distance. Ah, resources. And a weapon, but you don't have a free slot to install it. Decide for yourself whether you want to equip or salvage it. There is an outlaw ship incoming. I would advise activating your weapon overdrive in order to prepare for the encounter. are essential for crafting and upgrading your equipment. 
It appears, however, that we have exhausted our possibilities here. I suggest advancing to the next location. What's my objective? Reaching your destination. And where is that? It's still a long way to go. You will understand more when we get there. I would prefer some more substance to your answers. You have extracted raw materials. These are essential for crafting and upgrading, but you will require much more. This will enhance your weapon damage considerably. I like the sound of that. Outlaws. Independent operators with varying affiliations, profiting from trafficking, extortion, illegal weapons trading, piracy, clone smuggling. Maybe they have something I need. What's this mining outfit I'm registering? Brady and Brunt Prospects. Corporate behemoth and sole legitimate operator in the demilitarized zone. Their monopoly has ensured unchecked expansion. You will encounter their jump gates and mining drones frequently.
That's just what I need. It appears we have stumbled upon an outlaw base. Scavengers and raiders of every degree ply the demilitarized zone using these hidden structures to launch operations. I would advise caution on approach. Maybe it's worth the risk. Some Okars just jumped in. I recommend evasive moves. You saying I should run from a fight? It's all the same to me. But we might get to our destination sooner if you know when to bow out. What am I picking up on the broadcast channel here? The Okar are a reptilian race with a tendency towards reactive behavior. They are indigenous to the cluster, and the Colonials uninvited guests. Distrust runs deep. Jump gates are the primary method of travel between systems. These were built by Gradient Brunt Prospects for their mining drones to reach areas more efficiently. Okay, thanks for the introduction. Now you want me to use this? It is the only way to the next sector, so yes. Your vessel harvests plasma automatically when you are near. That's convenient.
did Grady and Brunt manage to get the only contract in the DMZ? They were first on the scene, due to their extensive jump gate infrastructure. So far as their monopoly is concerned, their close working relationship with the Colonial Fleet was undoubtedly a factor. of memories, trying to make sense of them. I had managed to escape. I was weak and ill. My cells were deteriorating. A deadly poison, a cytotoxin. A slow, relentless, eating me away. There was a way to halt its progress, but it would take time. All I could do was set the wheels in motion. And await the outcome in stasis. A long, uncertain sleep. I saw myself again. Dying. This must be a memory from your original. Apparently a flaw in the transference protocol. The Eterna system was meant to filter such personal recollections. Wait, what are you saying? My original? I'm a... A clone, yes. Usually this is not realized by limited use copies. The function of it... Eterna was to pass on operational skills, such as piloting. But it seems that something has gone wrong. Stop. This is a lot to take on board all at once. Why is this happening? Who am I? Who is my original? I have no information on that. Perhaps there is a purpose to this aberration which will become clear upon reaching the coordinates given. I have no answers, unfortunately. But I am as curious as you are. a superior fighter. It will be harder to take down. <laughs> we'll have to see about that. <laughs> 